Hey everybody, in this video we're going to go over how to compute a weighted mean using Google Sheets. And actually I'm going to show you two different ways because you may be using a different program and some programs may not have the built-in feature. So let me show you uh, how to do this a little more old-fashioned way and then I'm going to show you the built-in command and how that works. And so what I've got is I've got this data. This is the 2017 AB Calculus AP test scores. And so on that test, you can score anywhere from a 1 to a 5. And there were about 310,000 students. And what we want to do is we want to compute what is the average score. Oh, now, if we want to compute the mean, that means we had have to add 5 this many times, add 4 this many times, 3 this many times, 2 and 1, and so on. Well, the quick way to do that is to say, well, if 5 happens... 74,400 times, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this cell, 5, and multiply by this cell. And so that gives me the total of what we would get if we would add 5 this many times. And so if I click and drag this down, now I've got all the totals for adding up the 5s, adding up the 4s, adding up the 3s, adding up the 2s, and adding up the ones. And so what I have to do then is add them up. So I'll just use the sum. I'll highlight that and press enter. And so this is the sum total of all the scores of all the students, but we want the average score. So in order to do that, I'm going to have to also say, well, how many students were there? Well, if I sum them up, we got 308,760. So if I want the weighted average, that's going to have to be this number, the total 907,370, divided by 308,760. There we go. So our average score is about 2.9. Now, again, that's the hard way to do it. And if you don't have this feature that I'm going to show you next, this is how you would do it. You would just multiply each number by how often it happens, get your total, and then divide by how often the total frequency happens. But the other way you can do it, at least on Google Sheets, is, let me type in equals and average. If you look down, it's start, starting to suggest things, and it says weighted average. And so first of all, it says, what are your values? And so I have to highlight these numbers, this array, first. Then I'll separate that with a comma, and then it says give me the weights, which is another way of saying frequency. And there you go. So that's the same approach, different approach, but getting the same number. So if you have this shortcut, by as well, might as well use it. But if you don't have it, you can use the method that I showed you first. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you have suggestions that you want to see worked out, type a comment below. To support the channel, click the Patreon link to help keep this going. Thanks so much for watching, and remember, the best way to understand something is to do it.